DerpyCon 2014, The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly. DerpyCon was a multi-genre convention held from December 5th through 7th, 2014 at the Hyatt Morristown at Headquarters Plaza in Morristown, New Jersey. I have a conflict of interest. I was a guest. So, let's see what I experienced. For the good, the Hyatt Morristown was an excellent convention hotel. I had almost no problems with staff. Everything was just smooth. Even the security was pretty cool with the con being there. The rooms were nice. It sh everything was just really, really nice. Uh, free parking was a plus. Uh, you validate your parking at the desk. It was really simple. And that made the con even better. This has been some of the best con staff I've ever worked with, dealt with. They were all really, really awesome. Saw a lot of people from other conventions I knew. Um, the staff were, were... They were almost like a staff of a con that could have been seven years old. They were experienced. They did good work. They were helpful. They were friendly. They did everything you want out of a convention staff. For a first-year con, the dealer's room was really solid. They had a couple of Oz and Ends dealers, some uh, toy dealers, some anime dealers, arts and crafts, uh, the usual stuff you see in a dealer's room. Definitely good for a first-year con, and i got to give a lot of credit to the Masquerade. They made it a little different than others. They kind of mixed up where the skits and the karaoke and all that stuff was, and they got it done in about an hour. It did start a little bit late, but that wasn't bad. They moved it through, made it entertaining, and it was probably one of the better masquerades I've seen in a long time. I did not experience anything downright bad at this convention. The con itself had a lot of problems with Video 1. They were very, very honest about it. Video 1 did not work correctly for them. And they are taking action to fix it next year. Some people would consider the panel rooms really, really bad as they were small. It just meant you got to know the audience better. So I can't say there was anything flat out bad. Now, Ugly, what should have been better? I kind of felt the attendance might have been a little bit low. They had 727 warm bodies, so you have anywhere between five to 600 paid attendees. I don't know, it was a little low, maybe it could have been a little higher, but it was a first year con. That's why I have a question mark there. Was it low, was it high? It's hard to tell because there's really nothing to compare to it. The recent YushiCon had around 160 attendees at the East Stroudsburg uh, University, so this actually might have been really good. Uh, the area outside the hotel was more complex than I personally expected. The hotel was located on the side of a hill, and I did have some trouble finding food. The food guide didn't work on my phone. I should have looked at it before I came to the con, but I just ran out of time. And next time I come to the con, I'll be much better prepared. But if you head the one way, you end up in a neighborhood. You walk the other way, you end up in, like, the outskirts of a town business district. It turns out you have to kind of go behind the hotel and go down a hill. And there's a lot of food places down there. So before you go to the Hyatt Morristown, you really kind of have to do your research. And that's why I've chose to mark it as ugly. Overall, DerpyCon was very well run for a first year convention, and they spent a lot of time thinking it out, and it was very, very obvious. And I am looking forward to next year. I hope to be able to return. I intend to return. I think this is a convention you're going to have to keep an eye on, because there's a lot of good things that I think are going to come out of this convention. They're really taking the time to think things out, and they're going to fix their problems. I know the con chair, Anthony... He's a guy that wouldn't let problems stand. He's not He's not going to let them just sit there and fester. He's going to get them fixed. And honestly, for a first-year convention, there was not that many problems. I would give it a B. It was a solid first-year effort. This, this would have been a solid year for most any convention. And they just did a really, really good job. Thanks for watching.